always wanted to make money in Grand Theft Auto V without leaving your house or having to do any missions or do anything at all except for press a couple of buttons. Well, today I'm going to be showing you a new tutorial on how to make a ton of money. This is an actual way in real life to make money, but you have to be really smart and you have to be really quick. Alright, so first, we're, I'm going to be teaching you how to play with stock market. Now, the stock market is a tricky type of thing because it, it's like pretty much you're giving money. Like, let's say I buy a $100 stock for Google. Now, obviously Google's not in Grand Theft Auto V, but this is just an example, you know. So, let's say I buy a $100 stock for Google. It is a $100 value. Now, if the stock goes down for Google, then mine goes down. So that $100 could reduce to $50, to $5, whatever the drop is, it can actually drop your money. So it's like you have $100, but you really don't have $100 anymore. So it's like, hey, you save up your money, you get $100. I'm going to try the stock market out and see if I can make a few bucks, you know? Well, if you mess up and you don't back out early or leave or quit or sell the stock when the prices are going up and you wait too long and they're going down then you lose your money so I'm going to be teaching you how to play with the stock market on Grand Theft Auto 5 now um, beware with this because you can lose a lot of money but you can also gain a lot of money so first I would start out with you know a couple it just depends how much money you have. Like, if you have $100,000, I want to be doing, like, tens of thousands because you could lose it really easily, and it's pretty hard to get the money back because, first off, you do need the money to begin this. That's the first step. You need money. Um, you can start out with $100 if you want. But let's just go ahead and go on our phone and go on to the Internet really quick. And I am really sorry for this blur. I'm going to go ahead and fix that. There you go. Alright, so, pretty much, you just want to head over to Money and Services, and you want to click on the first one, LCN. And this is basically the stock market right here. Now, as you can see, this little chart right here shows you the days of when the stock rose. Like, right here, the stock is pretty, like, right here, right here, the stock rose. And it, it decreased right here, so let's say... It's Sunday and a half, and th this gets pulled every 30 seconds. So every 30 seconds, your money changes if you buy a stock. So let's say I buy the stock at 12 a.m. on Sunday morning. So the stock starts to increase. Let's say I get too greedy and don't sell it yet. Well, it can decrease and I lose value. And I'm going to want to back out as quick as possible so I don't lose even more money. But... If I would buy it right here and it would increase, however long you wait and when it gets to the peak, you want to sell it and make the most money. So like right here, AUG is at its best with 98 change. Now that's plus. The minus is bad. <laughs> you know, it's pretty simple math, but let's just check out the market really quick. So this is the actual businesses and markets um, on the game. These are all the businesses, and you really want to pay attention if you're going to invest in a stock. You want to invest in something that's going up in price, not something that's going down. See, like, right here, Cool Beans is 4% high. You want to watch it, all right? You you don't want to go ahead and buy the stock just because it's rising 4%. Like, especially this one, 42%. You probably don't even want to buy that one at all because it could, it could decline at any moment right now. It's already at its peak, probably, so... You want to start out with something small, even maybe negative one, and a little negative, you know. But four percent sounds pretty good. Even one percent sounds good. So let's say that the stock is two hundred eighteen dollars, like it is right here at the current price, two hundred eighteen bucks. So it's at one percent increase. You probably want to buy it, and then you want to wait for it to max out. You probably want to watch it before you buy it, though. Like I said. Uh, watch it for a day or a an hour, I don't know, just look at it and then play the game, come back to it and see what if it increases. If it increases, you want to wait for it to drop back down. Once it drops back down, you want to purchase it. I guess we can go ahead and purchase. I got $28 million, what do I have to lose? <laughs> 
I've actually been playing with this a lot. And if if I invested $28 million, let's say, let's go back to the markets. You see AUG right here, which is at its all-time high, 42%. Let's say I bought this when it was at 1%, so it would be $100. Now let's say I spent $20 million. Divide 20 million by 100, and that's like 200,000, I think. 200,000. So that's $200,000 at its current price. Let's say the stock increases by 42%. Bam. You get 42% of 200 grand. So that's probably a $90,000 increase. So that you get two hundred ninety thousand dollars back, so you increase ninety grand. Now that that doesn't seem like a lot at first, but see, like, look at the web page. The color even changed. It's always changing. You gotta make sure you're uh, on top right now. But I don't think this is the right one. Let's go back. We were on a different stock market. We want to be on this one. This one. Um, it's get it's getting kind of long, and I just want to get this video over with already. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like. Uh, subscribe for more awesome GTA 5 videos, and thanks for watching.